The list of things that might kill us keeps getting longer. I hadn't even thought about moonshots. Brax, skags, bandits, dehydration, heat stroke, regular stroke, stroke, stroke. Whatever that is. That murder pile. The list just keeps getting longer. I've never felt so alive! <laughs> this is awesome! I can't imagine going back to financial reports. Ugh, boring! That's the spirit, buddy. It's just... I know it's weird to say, but I'm having a great time. Fun. I feel the same way. This! This is what I'm talking about! Mixing it up with Hyperion, teaming up with grifters? Come on, these are the types of stories we'll tell our children when we're millionaires! We just survived moonshots from Hyperion, huh? Friggin' moonshots, man! I am not afraid anymore! You hear me, Hyperion? I am Vaughn, and I am not afraid! Yo, what the hell was that? Relax, it's a vet. Oh, okay. I have to pee. And not because I was scared. I, I had to go anyway. This is perfect timing. Freeze, you're alive. <sighs> Thank God you guys are okay. I thought that was it for a second there. I am so relieved. So, thanks for the warning. Trust me, I tried. I did. Tell her to send some supplies! Yeah, don't talk to me while you're peeing. Thank you. Sorry! Almost done! Anyway, I got them to stop shooting, but I can't keep Vasquez from wanting to take you guys out. I'm doing what I can, but it's chaos up here. So I can't talk long. Hey, Yvette, are you able to locate Loaderbot? We kinda lost him racing away from the moonshots. I'm not picking up a signal just yet. Look, I'm able to track you, so stay safe for now. I'll send what I can. Cool. Hopefully she can help us out. We can't be walking through the desert too long. I mean, not without water. To go through all this and die of dehydration would be pretty lame. Uh, fun? We should get you to a vet. What? Why? What's happening? Because those pythons look sick. Huh? Your arms are... I... I don't... You are weirdly buff, dude. That's what I'm... I put an exercise bike in my office a few months ago. Don't worry about it. Right. He is pretty young. <laughs> I gotta say, I'm a little envious of the definition he's got going. It's saving the world. It doesn't leave you much time for the gym. I mean, I've got muscles where it matters, sure. But, uh... Damn, I could never get that tone. Would you stop sneaking up on me? <sighs> Who's sneaking? I don't sneak. Oh, so you've been here this whole time? Yeah. Oh. Reese, who are you talking to? So he definitely can't see me, right? You're kind of freaking me out, Reese. Hey, so remember earlier when uh, I said I could see Handsome Jack? Sure, right after you fell off the ledge. <laughs> oh, yeah, right. Well, it's true. Uh, he's standing right next to you. Right. Right. So, Handsome... <laughs> handsome Jack is standing next to me. Yes. And I can't see him, but you're able to see him and also talk to him. Correct. He definitely thinks you're crazy. Who exactly is this little muscle-bound tool? <laughs> I'm not crazy. <laughs> <sighs> okay. Ask him how many fingers I'm holding up. Uh, I don't know. He's scratching his ass and... uh. Oh! God, I think he may have pissed on his shirt. That's not yeah, clean. How many? Three. Three. You're holding up three fingers. Lucky guess. You know it's not. Come on. We should get out of the sun. I... I don't understand. Yeah, yeah, join, join the, the club. club. Jinx. Let's go. I can't tell if I'm crazy or, or you're crazy. Yeah, I don't know what state of being uh, I'm in right now, but, uh, well, walking still sucks. Man, what are the odds? What does he mean? Yeah, what do you mean? 
Well, I mean, of all the people in the universe, Handsome Jack could be appearing to, it just happens to be the guy who's totally obsessed with him. <laughs> I mean, it's crazy! It's like destiny. Uh, what? Should I be creeped out right now? Because I'm feeling a little creeped out. This is just a coincidence, Vaughn. Men make their own destiny. You sound like Vasquez. You sound, uh, like you're dodging the question. Uh, you obsessed with me, Cupcake? I mean, think about it. You got all those handsome Jack posters in your office, dude. I think that's a little weird. That makes two of us. Yeah, those are motivational posters. You know, like the cat, hang it. They're Hyperion issued. Well, maybe it has something to do with the Nakayama drive. Namayaka. What, why does that sound familiar? Uh, I did shove a bunch of data, you know, <laughs> straight into my head. Ah, uh, Nakayama, right. The weirdo that was obsessed with me. The other weirdo that was obsessed with me. Oh, man. Hyperion would kill to get their hands on this. This? You! Your head or body or whatever Jack is in. Yeah, they would, wouldn't they? Whatever version of Jack you've got in there, Nakayama stored it for a reason. Damn right, even this idiot gets Hyperion it. Hyperion would scour the ends of Pandora to get it. We don't tell anyone. Not at least until we what? figure no, out no, what No, 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 no. You need to get me back yeah, to Helios. you're probably right. No, no, you are definitely wrong. This is torture. That's, that's what it is. I'm in hell. This is what hell is. <laughs> It's about time. That's gotta be Yvette. So, I guess she's sending a new loader bot. Uh-oh. Incoming! <laughs> it's coming right for us. Hey, I guess that tracker's working, huh, boys? It's coming right <laughs> for us! Come to Baba! Nice sock. Fancy meeting you two here. Here I was, out for a nice drive, and I land right on just the guys I was looking for. How did you find us, Hugo? Ho ho ho! <laughs> You're Hyperion property, Reese. Hyperion doesn't lose track of its property. Look. I know we had a deal. And uh, while I don't like to go back on an agreement made man to man, the circumstances. Hey, that's I right, we did have a deal. You convinced me to double cross my best friend, and the day isn't even over before you're double crossing me? Oh, <laughs> oh man. When you put it like that, it does sound awful. Dev, what? Shouldn't know better than to trust a snake like you. Oh, don't be like that, little guy. It's just the way of the, uh... Listen, I'm gonna go see if I got a shirt in the trunk, because your body is making me uncomfortable. Hold tight, kids. Look! I told him I would sell you out, but I swear I wasn't gonna do it. I was just saying whatever he wanted to hear just to keep that jerk off our backs. I wasn't gonna follow through with it. Please believe me. I swear, Reese, I would never... It's cool. Is it? Sure. I can't tell if... What's that? There, shovels, genius. You two freaks start digging. I want to see a decent grave going before too long. You heard me. Don't make me tell you again. Oh, you're gonna pay for this. You'll see. 
Yeah, because we have friends, dangerous friends, that will hunt you down to the ends of Pandora. Well, that... that, uh, that sounds exhausting. Well, I guess it's a good thing I'll be leaving this ball of hot garbage real soon. What part of Dig don't you understand? Let's get going, Mr. Universe. Okay, just don't shoot. There you go. A little hard work never killed it. Dig faster. Time is money, Reese. Really? You want me to dig my own grave faster? <laughs> Reese! Oh. 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 Damn. Damn, that smarts. I think I did that wrong. I... You got a tough noggin. Looks so easy in the movies, but... Amateur hour. You gotta aim for the bridge of the nose, dum-dum. How is it every time I show up, you idiots are in a worse situation? <laughs> You're not helping. <sighs> All right, fun's over. Looks like we'll be settling for the shallow variety of grave. Reese, you die first, and then he can load your body in the car. I'll bury Vaughn myself. What? Yeah, they want this idiot's body for something up there. Something, uh, important floating around in his head. This is a prototype. The most advanced gun Hyperion has ever made. Someone's overcompensating. Any last words? Before the what is it? With the inevitable end of your gosh. You don't even know how to use that thing. Maybe you should have read the manual, huh? Manuals are for amateurs. Damn it! Uh, is there a problem? I there? know how to shoot a gun. I just want to get the maximum damage out of this thing. Okay, look. As much as I'd love to watch this idiot kill you two idiots, I can't let that happen. I'm, I'm inside of... I'm not inside you, but I'm like, look, if you go, I go. I've enhanced your Echo Eye, so use it to hack something and get us the hell out of this jam. Figure out how you can pay me back later. I've got you back. Right. Okay, mess this guy up. It's heavy, but... <laughs> oh! Get your subsystem Sorry, access, so. that's new. Where? This is a button. There's a button on a gun you can do. Whoa! Did you do that? And paranoia! It begins. Push this in. Push this in and nothing's happening. Fine bullets. Oh. Surprise! What the hell's going on? Uh, I'm, I'm not doing that. Oh, hello. <laughs> this is an interesting little development. Fine, look, we gotta go. This is my head. Get out! Oh, come on, don't be like that. Oh! Oh, you see, you see what you did? You hit your race. Yeah. Go ahead and run! You're just making this butter for me! This isn't over! You 
hear me? You hear me? Hey! So should we be going to Hollow Point or straight to Old Haven? I mean, they know where we're going. Maybe we should just meet them there. Well, I guess we could just meet them in Old Haven and get a head start. Or we could always just go to Hollow Point, though that might be dangerous. Man, this is a big decision. <laughs> It's weird, but I, I always, uh, you know, talk to myself during, you know, huge choices. It's just something I do, and I, I know it's just, you know, super important. I, I'm not talking to you. I'm, I'm talking to me right now. So, anywho, probably should just choose something. Well, that's probably enough out of me. We'll meet them at Hollow Point. Then we'll go together, like a family. Sounds good. To Hollow Point. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry. It was just to keep Vasquez off of us. Like I said, I would never betray you, bro. Do you forgive me? Just say yes, because I feel like super bad right now, bro. Even though I wasn't going to go through with it. Not even worried about it, bro. Man, I'm so relieved to hear you say that, bro. I knew you'd never betray me, bro. Never, bro. Never. Thanks, bro. Hey, we're bros, bro. That's bro, bro. Bro! For bro, bro, bro. Bro, 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 We should probably let him finish. Fine. I'm curious. Why would you choose to go to Hollow Point? What was there to gain? I'm growing impatient. Well, despite what you might call a lack of skill, I've moved up through the ranks at Hyperion fairly quickly. Straight to the mill. And I've been able to do that because of one thing. And one thing only. Loyalty. As evidenced by your former boss trying to kill you. We all have our reasons. I suppose yours are good enough. If they were, we wouldn't be here. A man can only take so much. Luckily, you're a safe distance from a man. <laughs> we were stranded in the desert. You had a car. Did you even consider coming to get us? We had our own... One of you will have to change a tire. will be okay. I'm sure they'll figure something out, probably, but um, the Badlands are practically a graveyard. If they're smart, they have a chance. I'm not convinced two Hyperion desk jockeys know the first thing about survival in the Badlands. 
All they have to do is find a shelter and build a fire. They're dead. With a caravan like this, we couldn't help them if we wanted to. I hope he'll fix it. We're not exactly rolling in cash right now. How are you gonna get him to do it? I mean, I'm assuming it's not exactly a charity. And we definitely cannot get out of here if we don't get this fixed. Oh, please. This is me doing this? Nothing I can't handle. Okay, don't get too cocky. We'll figure it out, don't worry. Stay here. I'll do the talking. Wouldn't have it any other way.